Once upon a time, in a land not so far away, there was a girl named Patricia. Yeah, that's me. I think they know this already. Right, right. And Patricia was on a mission? To learn about the kingdom of God and what makes it so different from all the other kingdoms in the world. Can we get going? Where's Alex? Right. Well, Alex is Patricia's tutor guide here in the kingdom of heaven. That's me. I'm here. Sorry for the hold up. Are we ready to get going? I was just in the middle of my introduction, so I was saying... As you were saying, Alex has been taking me on adventures around the kingdom, so let's go. Aye, fine. You guys go have fun. I'll just be over here if anybody needs me. Thank you, narrator. I think I can take it from here. All right, Patricia, I have a very special adventure for us today, so here we go. What in the world? We're on a boat? That's right, we're on a boat! Did you know that Jesus went on boats too? Yeah, I guess now that I think about it, he did go sailing a lot with his disciples. Well, I just wanted to show you more of the beauty of God's kingdom, which as we know, is actually all of creation. Nice, but hold on a second. What's that over there? Uh, it looks like another boat. I wonder what they're doing today. It looks like they're also on a tour, just like us. But aren't you the official tour guide of the Kingdom of Heaven? I wonder if they have a proper license to be doing that. Well, I can't see the harm in them touring around and enjoying God's creation too, as long as they're not doing anything against us. I guess, but if I were you, I'd be asking them if they have a license. It's like they're taking over your job. You know, that kind of reminds me of something Jesus once said. You see, one time he was hanging out with his disciples and doing miracles, just regular old Jesus stuff. <laughs> and then they came across someone else who was also doing miracles. What? How could anyone do miracles other than Jesus and his disciples? <laughs> That's what the disciples said. In fact, John even tried to stop that person from doing it. But you know what Jesus said? What did he say? Well, he said not to stop them, because whoever is not against us, well, they're for us. Huh, really? Well, that's surprising. Yeah, Jesus wasn't upset or jealous when others were also doing miracles like he was because that means that God's power and goodness is being seen everywhere. There's always more of God's goodness to go around. In the world, people are always competing against each other, but it doesn't seem to be that way here in the kingdom of God. There's no need for competition here. We're all a part of God's great big family. So long as someone isn't doing harm and is actually doing good, then they're on our team too. Like those guys over there. Hey! It kind of makes me think about how as Christians we sometimes have our differences. But at the end of the day, we're all God's children. That's exactly right. I think you're getting it. And what a wonderful lesson Patricia has learned on her tour of the kingdom of God. Or the kingdom of heaven. Or the new creation. However you want to call it. I'm never going to get used to that voice. To be continued. <laughs>